Hi students, welcome to this session on uh, intrinsic impedance. Right, so uh, this is a very very important term. We must know about this impedance. Right, so what is intrinsic impedance? Intrinsic impedance is a impedance I encountered by an EM wave, electromagnetic wave. When traveling through a medium. So it is the impedance faced by a electromagnetic wave when traveling through a medium. That's what intrinsic impedance. So it is also known as wave impedance. Okay, both are same only. And the symbol for a intrinsic impedance is eta. Right? So uh, we have a few more definition for that. So, if we the intrinsic impedance is uh, defined is in the in terms of electric field and magnetic field because it is EM wave facing that uh, impedance. No, so intrinsic impedance eta is given by ratio of magnitude of electric field to the magnitude of uh, magnetic field. How it has become impedance, you see what is the unit of electric, electric field, volt per meter. What is the unit of magnetic field, ampere per meter, so meter goes on. So V by volt by ampere, it is nothing but your resistance or impedance. So input in, uh, intrinsic impedance is given by the ratio of magnitude of electric field to the magnitude of uh, uh, magnetic field, right? So this we can derive from Maxwell's equation also. Okay, then uh, if you know permeability and permittivity, the intrinsic impedance in terms of that is given by uh, eta is equal to root of mu by epsilon. Right. So this is another way. So where mu is equal to mu naught uh, mu r, we know that is uh, epsilon is equal to sorry epsilon naught epsilon r right so this is what uh, intrinsic impedance of uh, any medium right in free space what happens mu r is equal to 1 epsilon r is equal to 1 so mu naught by epsilon naught right in free space we know mu naught is given by it is absolute permeability so 4 pi into 10 power minus 7 what is that henry per meter this is 8.854 into 10 power minus 12 farad per meter so if you simplify uh, if you simplify this what you get is eta is equal to 377 ohm or 125 right if you simplify you will get 125 this is what uh, intrinsic impedance of a free space fine so it has a value so when wave travels through a free space it will face the impedance of 377 ohm okay so another one thing you have to know about intrinsic impedance is for a medium with conductivity sigma, for medium with conductivity sigma associated with the intrinsic impedance can be defined as Z is equal to J omega mu divided by J omega epsilon plus sigma. Right, so this is for medium with conductivity. This is, so we have a three different kinds of definition. So for a medium with permeability and permittivity, eta intrinsic impedance is given by root of mu by epsilon. For free space, it is 120 pi or 377 ohm. For uh, intrinsic impedance in terms of electric field and magnetic field is given by E by H. Simply, it is an impedance encountered by the electromagnetic wave when it is traveling through a medium. I hope you understand the meaning of uh, intrinsic impedance. If you have any doubt, please ask me in comment section. Thank you.